welcome back. Let's. There we go. Last time I was having mega problems with the volume and I had to go and fix it, but I think I can take care of it. Alrighty. Let's GTFO and take care of our last two friends at the fish apartments. Now, when I was a kid, I hated the manatee. Like, I thought he was so obnoxious. And. But now I think he's kind of sad. Whoop! Well, what you need, Al Adam? I mean, look at him. He's like a piss poor dude. He has a toolbox. They miss Gregarious's parents. And look, he has a little garden. I mean, he's not so bad. I think it's sad that. Why are you so blue, Gregarious? I'm all holding my breath. Why on earth are you doing that? You see these bandages? I keep getting hit by the same dumb spiegel every time I go to the surface to breathe. Dang propellers! I'm just not going up there anymore. You're gonna die, dude. But you're, but you're a mammal. You have to go up to breathe or you'll suffocate. Nope, nope, nope. Don't care. I ain't going. That propeller has just gotten the last piece of gregarious a manatee. Bye, Gil. I... I wish I knew how to do a Captain Haddock voice, because I would 100% do a Captain Haddock for Gregarious and make him be like, blistering barnacles! How about if I go up with you? You can show me the boat while we're up there. Maybe you can do something about the propellers. Gee, Adam, you do that for me? <laughs> what a pal. Follow me. Or I do a goofy voice, but I'm... <laughs> Adam, where are you going? <laughs> Look, it's a manatee bite! Adam follows Gregarious as he leads the way up out of the city towards the ocean surface. A load of garbage appears from somewhere above. That really is disgusting. Not to mention, I think I said this in one of the earlier LPs, bizarre. Some of the crap that you throw- Like, what is that, a sandwich? What the hell? Like, who does that? This is Captain Haddock! I spoke too soon! This is the real Captain Haddock! It for sure feels good to breathe. Is this the boat? Yep, yeah, gosh darn propellers anyway. Oh my god, it really is Captain Haddock! I'm so glad I didn't give him a Captain Haddock voice. Gregarious eyes the boat warily, but at least he's no longer blue. Adam gets embarrassed when people stare. The fisherman has a face as tanned and wrinkled as old leather. Though he looks tough and steady as a rock, he doesn't appear to be particularly unkind or spiteful. Sup, dude? Hey, Mr. Fisherman! Who said that? I'd poop myself. If I were out at sea, enjoying a nice smoke, maybe having a glass of wine or something on my boat, and this voice goes, Hey, how are you doing? I think I would either pass out or defecate in my pants because that's... What? Who said that? <gasps> I'm down here! This isn't God talking! Oh, a diver, eh? Why didn't you say so? Blistering barnacles! We just swam up through some of your trash that you bizarrely tossed. Why does that man need a hairdryer? Lots of creatures have to live in the ocean. You shouldn't dump your stuff in here, you know. What's that? Creatures, is it? What do you think I'm fishing for? I'm gonna eat your friends, Gregarious! And I'm going to enjoy every bite. The ocean's a big place, matey. A little bit of trashing I heard the fishing's none. But it does! You wouldn't believe all the trash down there. Anyway, that's not why I came to talk to you about. It's about Gregarious. Gregarious? That's a heck of a dumb name. A heck of a name for just a dumb manatee. And what's all, all them bandages for, anyhow? I like how this guy just rolls with it. And they have the same hat. Maybe I should have given them the same voice. Maybe this is done on purpose. They're supposed to be reflections of each other in different worlds some kind of deep commentary because you keep hitting him with your propellers what now my propellers my, my propellers did that he says every time he comes up to breathe your boat runs into him well i'll be a landlubber blistering barnacles what should i do about that 
don't worry, Adam's here to save the day. Which, I'm, to be perfectly honest, I'm not sure this would work, but I haven't done a lot of nautical seafaring, so who am I to say? Sure, Adam. Adam, I love this little animation right here for them attaching this. Whew. I just, look at the bandages. With Gregarious' help, Adam fits the steel cage over the propellers and fastens it with the four, four screws. One thing I will say is Captain Haddock over here really doesn't like Gregarious, because look around, there are no other boats in the area, and Gregarious is fairly certain that that's the same exact boat that's hit him every single time. That means that this man has purposely been running over Gregarious, or hoping to run over Gregarious. I just... Oh, I see what you're talking about now. That cage jimmies right over them propellers, don't it? I think I started doing Gregarious voice, whatever. Yep. Now you don't have to worry about them manatees. Thanks, son. You're not too bad for a kid. Thanks for making my boat safe. Guess I'll think about what you said about the garbage dumping blistering particles. Thanks. Bye now. Bye, kid. I'm gonna have a drink. Adam and Gregarious returned to the ocean below because we were too lazy to animate it. For some bizarre reason, even though we animated them going up, Thank you, Adam. Now I can breathe any time I want to. Will you go to the mayor's meeting at the council chambers now? Well, I'll have to wait till everybody's out of the apartment, but I am the watchman, you know. But I'll go along as soon as I can. Okay. Bye. GTFO. The stuff he threw away is utterly weird. See, a sandwich? Why would you throw away a full sandwich? I, I knew it! He is a wino! Ha <laughs> ha! I was absolutely right. He was having a glass of wine. At least that one kind of makes sense. But the hairdryer makes almost no sense. Oh, it's a waste pump. A water pump. It's still kind of weird. Anyway. Um, so we're gonna get rid of this. Adam just says no. Don't say no, Adam. Wine is a beautiful thing. Apparently this is not considered garbage because... Da -da 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 -da, we need it! Um, and I think I have time to finish up the fish apartments before the end of this video, so... Let's go. This is my other favorite fish, by the way. I think she's super cool. She's not nearly as funny as um, Epidermis, but I don't know. If... If I drew more often, which I should, but I don't, um, I, I would definitely draw her. Adam picks up the bleach bottoms, bottle, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> enough with the bottoms. Adam picks up the bleach bottle and stores it away in his garbage bag. That'll stop the new bleach from leaking into the water, but the apartment is still full of this stuff. Da 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 da. I like the way he's kicking, like, brr, 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 as the water goes out. Adam uses the water pump to cycle old contaminated water out to the much bigger area of the open sea. Yay! Oh my, what happened here? You used a bottle of bleach for your table, and the bleach knocked you out. I'm afraid bleach is one of those man-made dangers you'll have to watch out for. How are you feeling now? Oh, I, I'm fine. Just a little woozy. My name's Olympia. Who are you? I'm Adam. I'm here to tell the citizens about a meeting in the council chambers. The mayor asked everyone to come. A, a meeting? You mean with other fish? I'm, I don't know. I'm, I'm pretty shy, I'm afraid. I don't like crowds. Why not? Well, it's my spines, you see. They're quite poisonous. I can't help it, you know, but there it is. I'm always afraid that others will be afraid of me or that somehow accidentally. But you can't just hide in your room. Oh my god, I just realized why I like her. She's the fish version of Fluttershy from My Little Pony Friendship is Magic. And yes, I watched that show, Don't Knock In, until you tried it. It's excellent. Everybody needs friends. Listen to me. I sound like my dad. Oh god, not my father. I guess he's right after all. Anyway, I think you're really nice and your spines are super cool. Frankly, in real life, I'm a huge fan of lionfish, and I agree with Adam. You, 
you like my spines? I never thought anyone could like my spines. But, well, maybe I could go. It is important, I think. Maybe your spines could help the other citizens. If you truly like my spines, perhaps you'll accept a gift for saving my life. This locket contains one of my baby spines. It's quite potent, though. Be careful how you use it. She's so cute. I can't stand it. Wow, a lionfish spine. Me. Thanks, Olympia. Goodbye, Adam. May you be free from stins as long as you live. And her name is Olympia, which I think is hilarious in um, comparison with Olympia Miklos in Laura Bow. Olympia Miklos, who isn't shy at all, and talks like she has lots of... She is very into scars. Ooh, that was a good Olympia Miklos. All right, everyone. Um, I, unfortunately, has got, got to do some stuff IRL. Part of the stuff why I've been so busy. Um, hopefully, I'll be recording very, very soon, and we'll get to uh, sting ourselves. Can we shut us? All right, I'm going to stop this now. Good night, everybody.